this is our hat for today for this flight. This is my airport outfit. At least I save at least one kilo because I think these clothes are one kilo. Oh, Right. There's a lot of questions in my case as well because this is my first time traveling after pandemic. G. We are walking right now looking for the street food because we're super super hungry. We don't have proper meal for two days. Fruits and buns. Sausage. Sorry. We have a few street food right here that we are going to try. Beef bowl. Beef bowl. So right now guys, we are here in Cebu and we are getting ready for our flight later. This is our hack for today for this flight. I have this inner. This one. We're gonna pour all the stuff that we can. It's already, right? And then, for us to have lighter, because we didn't pay any check-in luggage, so we're going to do hand carry. And on top of my inner, I have this dress. Yeah, the heaviest dress I have. So that's why I am wearing it right now. After that, this jacket. What do you Was it my reflection? This is my airport outfit. At least I save at least one kilo because I think these clothes are one kilo. All in ha! Right? Ha! Hello! We'll see when we get to the airport. Yeah, we are heading. Bye bye. So from our hotel, we took a taxi to SM Cebu City, and took my bus at SM Cebu to airport because it's cheaper this way. We paid only fifty pesos per person, and don't forget to ask the teller what time is the next bus to the airport. Usually, they have scheduled every thirty minutes or one hour. We decided to head early to avoid the rush hour traffic. They also have bus going to SMC side, vice versa. So guys, we are here at the International Airport. We've been sitting here, um, roaming around the airport for about four hours already and our flight is not yet started with check-in. We're waiting for our friend Gladys. She's coming, but I don't know where she is right now. She didn't reply to us. I am tired. We are tired. <laughs> but we're excited. Finally, after a few hours, it's check-in time. If you have hand carry, I suggest to check in online to avoid the long lines. But make sure don't exist the 7 kilograms hand carry policy. I can travel with just hand carry for many months. So guys, we are done with our immigration and I'm glad everything goes well in, <laughs> in my case. But in Daddy's case, there's a lot of questions. But there's a lot of questions in, uh, in my case as well because this is my first time traveling after pandemic and I don't know why is it first time because I've been traveling outside. Anyway, so we are here at Coffee Bean. We, I am eating some um, ham and cheese and then some muffin and then surprisingly this is 80 pesos water, 500 ml. This is airport. And guys, I don't have proper meal for the whole day. It's all 7-Eleven food, bread, and then this bread here at the airport. I think I can survive with just bread. It is what it is. Our flight was 1 a.m. in the morning. I realized it's super busy during this time because the flight was cheaper, so many people flying out at this hour. 
and it's my first time flying out with group of friends. Our flight will be 4 hours from Cebu to Singapore and then layover in Singapore for a few hours. Singapore airport was really amazing. It's very modern. They have bed chair where you can sleep that I didn't see in other airports I've been to. We didn't go to Jewel Airport because we were super tired and no sleep. So we decided to sleep instead while waiting for our flight. We don't have much time anyway. Walking around the airport, I felt poor because I can't afford this kind of brands. But that is fine because I am rich with experience traveling around Asia for now. Hopefully, we can upgrade and can travel to Western countries. The food in Singapore was pretty pricey for our budget. So I ended up eating a small sandwich, hoping it will last until we get to Chiang Mai for the cheap street food. You want to go to Europe, si Gladys? <laughs> Yay! So we are here at Changi Airport Place. Chi! So guys, we are now here at waiting for boarding and they have a very fancy waiting area for boarding. Three days. Three days. And that's here. They have mostly couch, not like um, airport chairs. Singapore. Welcome to Singapore. Singapore. Pero dili poor. Ready for boarding. Excited. We are so excited to explore Chiang Mai and I am more excited to travel after pandemic. This is my first time in a long time traveling to other country and I love the feeling that I can now travel again. And I'm so excited to travel to more other countries in the future. Once you arrive in Chiang Mai, don't forget to buy SIM card at the airport for data and use Grab app to book your taxis. Okay. Our taxi fare will be divided into three and the airport is pretty close to old city Chiang Mai. So guys, we are here right now at our guest house it's so weird because there's no one around here and we don't know how to figure out how we check in because i don't have data and i can't open my agoda <laughs> how did you know so this is what we read at the review is you have to check in by yourself because there's no one around they just left the key in this is it this is our room it's cute but the thing is there's no no one's welcome us it's spacious though this is the room they have tables they have bed which is this is queen i guess or double bed and this is king size so we found out that this is a shower in this area and right there is a toilet and they have doors that connects to each other Ta -da -da! Yay! <laughs> this is the cat that welcomed us we don't see anyone but only this kitty cat <laughs> we are walking right now looking for um, street food because we're super super hungry we don't have proper meal for two days so they got street fruits for 10 baht sausage Sorry. there's a lot of street food guys you'll survive here The street food stalls are located in front of Chiang Mai City High School. Thank you! Uh, meat? Uh, the one? Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, back.
So we're walking back to our place. We have a few street food right here that we are going to try. And I'm so excited. It's just super um, convenient for us because there's a lot of street food uh, nearby our place. I am so excited. Hi, good night. <laughs> It's so nice to explore some street food in other country. So this is where we stayed. So that one, that's a guest house, but no one is around when we were here earlier. Until now, they just left the key. Oops. And they have slippers. You have to change slippers. They also provide slippers. This is mine. Okay. Hi, me. You're black, na? <laughs> ah. I think they have black and white cats. Fish bowl and fruit. Beef bowl. <laughs> Beef bowl. <laughs> this one is fruit, mixed fruit. This is how much? 10? 20. 20. Uh, 20 baht. Here. This one is 20 baht. Oh, 10 and 10. Oh, my God. And this one is 10 and 10. <coughs> Spicy! I'm mean, gonna die. Okay. This one is yummy. Yummier than the one that we had in. <laughs> Everything is so delicious. Oh my god. Mm. Overall, all of the seafood are so yummy. Mongbi. This is mongbi. Mm. Some sour. Some sour. This is heaven. Because we're pretty hungry. <laughs> yes, that's true. Yeah. Mango. Mm. It's good. The least I like is this show mine. Thank you for the blessing. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, mango. Yeah. It tastes like uh, you get mango, but you more. You more like a big cup. Ah. 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 Huh? No, it's really good. I'm full. Me too. Ay! I am done. I am done eating, guys. So this is our yesterday's breakfast, yesterday's lunch and dinner. And today's breakfast, lunch and dinner later again. We're super hungry because we only ate bread. We only ate there. <laughs> we bring here. We only ate bread yesterday water. and early today. So. so they also have kitchen here that we can use. And they have washing machine. It's free to use if you're a guest. And I'm looking for water. I couldn't find any water. Let's get some tissue. And this is their waiting area if you are early check in and they have locker to put your things while you are waiting for your check in so we're heading to our next destination <laughs> Welcome to Lana Square. So if you guys enjoy, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos. And don't forget to click the notification bell to keep you updated. Thank you and bye everyone. When I saw you, I would lose control. Made me feel like there was no tomorrow. Should have told you that you're beautiful. But the days pass and now it's so long ago